Hey the wonderful people, welcome to my tutorial and in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to create a tennis ball, a football and a basketball. Okay so while was time let's get into the business and first of all I'm, doing this, I'm just going to show you how to create a football. So first thing first was going to go to create and then was going to was going to go to polygon media and then go to the soccer ball and you see it has already got a beautiful shape of football but you can do a, a more lot to it to make it a good look so for that uh, select vertex and select all the vertex of this guy and Go to Add Mesh and Detach. Okay. Now go to Deform with that object selected and hit this code. Okay, and before that, we have to smooth the faces. Right? The division will be 2. And now go to Deform and now we have got beautiful nice shape now what is it going to do is going to select this object and extrude and extrude it like this and what is it going to go is local translate G but before that press 4 and we have just got a little thing inside it it's a pale like thing and the, all the faces Inner faces are selected, so press backspace for that. And uh, now go to poly extrude face, go to look and press 5 and press 3. And there we go, you, you, you get this. But we have got a problem here. So go to local translate G and uh, like set the value as minus 0 0.03 and go to offset and set it minus 0 0.04 okay. and uh, you can see a beautiful thing it looks a little bit like football but what we can do here we can just uh, set the value as 0 0.5 R6, I'm not sure. I don't know. Yeah. So that's our football. Uh, that's our beautiful football. And uh, probably we can just set it like 0 0.07. Yeah. And listen. Now we have got a really beautiful football UV shell. You can also like, you know, like. Picture this one, but I'm just going to do this in this video. And that's our football. Okay, now uh, put it aside. <laughs> well, got the little spear thing, and to get rid of this, go to edit, double the time, and just do it. That's fine. Okay, uh, put it aside, and now we're going to create a tennis ball. For that I will be using a key. Everybody wondering like how can a tennis ball be produced out of a key? Yeah, that's the question. So what I'm just going to do here, I'm just going to smooth this guy. So for that, uh, let me show you again. Uh, press space and uh, the right mouse button at the same time, and you get this option. And I'm going to just with this two keys selected, you hold the keys and together and just select the smooth. Put your cursor on this smooth and just remove the keys. Okay, and that's what we exactly want when it comes to the keys. So I'm going to. 
going to here in the front view. Now select this vertex and this two vertices. Hit R and scale it as long as this two vertices gets flat. Okay, that's cool. Now we're going to select edges. Focus here. Selected. Press four to check out like all the faces, all the edges are selected. Yep, I reckon all the edges are selected nicely. Now go to go to shaded mode to press five, and there we go. And press Control and V. Okay, and we have got this one. All we have to do we have to just uh, use the fragment to probably minus one, uh, probably zero point one. Yep, I'll go for this and segment to be four probably. Okay, that's good. And uh, that's our tennis ball. Now if this is press three, and there we go. Like it's getting a shape of a tennis ball by degrees. Now. We are going to smooth this again and press it. Like press one. And this is what we have just got. It's like more beautiful tennis ball is just being made slowly. And now go to deform and hit scope. There we go. That's our tennis ball. That's our beautiful, nice looking tennis ball. And we're just going to smooth this one. Probably for twice, yep, like this. And uh, I'm going to uh, select this one and press Shift and double click on any face, and all the faces are selected. <coughs> now I'm just going to select the Shift key and select the greater than. Uh, less than keys you like select it and P select like this so with shift selected press the greater than keys on your, on your keyboard or dot key like this with face selected and we have this dot here and go to extrude and set the local transfer t as minus 0 0.0 t like this and press three. there we go we have got a beautiful tennis ball here nice looking tennis ball we're going to okay so press four Go to edit. I'm going to build the type and store. There, and this is our little tennis ball. Okay. And I'm just going to make a basketball. Okay. For that, I'm just I'm just going to take uh, this here. And I'm going to set the values as 16. And, uh, and 10. The subdivision exists 16 and subdivision is 15. Now we have to select all these edges like this. This edges, this edges, and this. Now hit backspace. We only leave 
is Oasis. Belong. Let's use our long T for T. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this basis right here and this basis. Right here. I'm just going to go to our multi clip tool, select the tool. And just uh, add two aces here. Basically, two aces here. And this two aces here. Like this. Okay. <clears throat> so now we're just going to. Mirror. So for that, go to go to mesh and mirror and uh, select. See. Go to mesh and mirror and um, go to bomb box Y and it's minus and mirror. There we go. There we go. And press three. So we got a problem here. So we have to select because uh, we have to merge all this uh, vertices. So go to edit mesh and merge, and do the same thing with this one. Edit mesh and merge. So we have got a beautiful. Uh, okay, we have got the same problem here. And so that all these vertices and go to merge. There we go. So everything is nice and beautiful. Now we are going to uh, set all these edges and we are going to select Ctrl B for bevel. We don't want this. That space between two is so we're just going to reduce the fraction as t 0 0.03 or 0 0.4, not 4, basically 0 0.35 or 0 0.3 maybe. Let's go. <laughs> okay, now I'm just going to. Uh, so all the spaces. Like this. And this one. And this one. Pro probably I have left one. Like this one. Okay, I'm just going to also bevel this one. So control B and select 0 0.3. 0 0.3. All the spaces like this. And now I'm going to extrude all the spaces and I'm going to set it like minus 0 0.02. So
tree and there we go and on the beautiful cool uh, we can also smooth this one if we want there we go i've got a cool good looking beautiful basketball i've got a cannon ball and i've got a football you can also smooth this one there so we have got three beautiful uh, balls that's our basket, that's our football and this one tennis ball okay so that was all <coughs> about making uh, these three balls so you can also just pick this thing at home and um, and thank you for watching this tutorial and probably I'll be back with another new tutorial um, and I will catch you guys in my next video till then chill out sign off bye bye